G'day folks. Well, I figured I'd just quickly have a look at this old GV400 Honda. Uh, it's starting to get in the way at the moment, so this will just be a preliminary examination and test. Uh, see if it's worth keeping or worth running. I find out if anything's really wrong with it, whether the coil's bad or something like that. Just as I found it. Complete. Obviously it's a vertical shaft engine, hence the V in the uh, uh, model designation GX. X means uh, horizontal shaft. So if it's a GV, it's GV part, it's for the vertical shaft version. So, I know it's free, it turns over now. Well, it seems to be stuck when I first got it. it may have had water in the cylinder, not too sure. But I'll set it up on the table and see from there. Well, I think I know what's wrong with this one. Damn exhaust valve stuck open. Oh, I'm going to hand over the muffler. I can feel it pretty clearly because there's no compression. Nothing there. You can feel it pushing in and out on every cycle. Exhaust valve stuck wide open. I'll just see if it's got spark as well, just in case, otherwise it's probably just a parts unit. If it's got no spark, that is. If it does have spark, then eventually I'll get around to freeing it up. Alright, quick spark test. Yeah, it's yeah it got spark. Just needs the exhaust valve freed up. Probably means taking the head off though. There is a valve chest cover on the underside there, but always difficult to get to without taking the carby and uh, muffler off. Ah, just for the hell of it, I thought I'd have a look inside the carby and see if there's any water getting down in there. Uh, there's no corrosion or nothing. Looks pretty good. I'm going to whip it off and just have a look inside the valve chest and see what's going on in there. Uh, I'm remember how all this governor stuff goes back together again spring and lever going down there to the governor itself and that's probably throttle or ch uh, choke control that operates off the cable they've obviously just ripped it straight off something I think I'll ride on mower or something like that just push button switch in there hmm yeah it's pretty much what I expected Exhaust valve stuck open. Oh, I'll try and free it up without uh, having to take the head off. Chances are water's just gotten down inside this muffler tube. It's all sort of homemade. Gotten down inside there and just rusted it out. Well, this is uh, definitely going to be a head-off job. And as one thing leads to another, I'm going to take the head off and fix this damn thing. No use fiddling with it halfway and then putting it aside. Well, as they say, off with its head! Oh yeah, this old thing's seen a bit of action. It's had a bit of water in it too. There's rust in there. Well, like an old Honda, it won't really hurt it. The valve definitely needs relapping after it's unseized. Head will clean up alright. I'll try and reuse the old head gasket because the new ones are a bit expensive. Yeah, it's alright. Worst thing is when they get stuck to the head and the block and you just tear them in half when you take the head off. But that'll be just fine. Looks like it's maintained its seal. A little bit there. Yeah, head gasket's been holding out fine. That's looking a bit better already. I haven't touched the valve yet, but I just thought I'd look at the bore and see what it came up like, and it's just fine. Like an old motorcycle guru I know told me, unless you've got major dollars invested in the engine, don't be afraid to take a bit of emery cloth and oil and just clean that sucker up. 
it's glazed or damaged like that. There's nothing wrong with a bit of cloth and oil. You don't have to hone it, you don't have to worry about taking the piston out. Just blow all the crap out, clean it all up and see how she goes. I mean, once it's running properly, it'll blow all the uh, remaining oil and dirt out the exhaust anyway. Hell, you've got nothing else to lose. Well, the inlet valve didn't need relapping, but I got the exhaust one done. All good. Time to put the head back on and see how much compression we've got. Alright, we've got some fuel and oil. Fresh oil change. Let's see what this old girl can do. The oven is set as it was at the factory, so I don't know what that's going to do. runs really well. <laughs> I can hardly hear myself think, but it runs. Try again. <laughs> 